When you think about sweat, you probably imagine intense exercise or stressful situations. And let's not forget body odor. However, researchers are learning that the science of sweat goes deeper than skin level stink. Monique Smeets, a social cognitive psychologist at Utrecht University, studies how sweat and body odor act as a social communication medium. Specifically, she looks at the secretions from apocrine glands, which produce sweat under emotional conditions. This sweat has lots of proteins and lipids in it that feed the bacteria on our skin and produce odors. She and her team compared the chemical composition of sweat from people experiencing fear, happiness, or neutral emotional states. They identified distinct and shared chemicals in these sweat samples. Smeet said that several other factors, including age, genetics, and diet, can influence one's odors. She added that understanding the interactions between these molecules and the microbes on our skin that produce them can explain new types of nonverbal communication. It turns out that there's more to sweat than may seem at first whiff.